Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's your boy Token Trend back at it again with another upload. Now, today's going to be a specific video to show you guys how to work OBS and your Elgato software together so you guys can live record or do whatever you guys want on there. It's going to be a specific tutorial, so I hope you guys do enjoy. Be sure to leave a like down below if you do. And as always, subscribe with the notification on. This video is sponsored by Build Store, the best place to get all your hacked apps at only a fraction of the price. Their link is down below if you guys want to go ahead and check them out. So, step number one, what you guys need to do is download the Elgato software if you guys haven't done it. Links in the description. You already know they're all there. They all should be marked as well. Also, install OBS Studio. This tutorial is only for PC. So, any Mac users, this won't be specifically the same for you guys. But if you guys want to follow along, that'll be all right as well. All right, guys. So, open up your Elgato software right here. So, as you guys can see, the PS4 is on and ready to go. So, all we have to do is click record. But we're not going to do that. We're just going to optimize some settings in here depending on what your PC can handle. So, I'm going to go in here and go to settings. This is a PlayStation 4, so it's on PlayStation 4. Make sure to change that. 1080 all the way up. Best quality. You already know. Change all the stuff you guys need to do. You don't really need to change anything else besides this. Click OK. And let's get out of here. So once that is finished, all you want to do is close that out. Make sure it's completely closed by checking over here. If it's still here, right click and then click exit or quit. That's all you got to do because you're not allowed to stream the Elgato software to two different softwares, only one. So what you guys want to do is go ahead and click add, right click and click add. Let's call this Twitch live stream. Now I am going to show you guys how to get your keys for YouTube and Twitch. So this is just like a name. You guys don't need to worry about that. It's going to be for both YouTube and Twitch. So what you guys want to do is be sure to go to add, right click again, add, go down to video capture device, call this Elgato. Click OK. Open up the Elgato software right there, Elgato Game Capture. Again, make sure it's not running in the background. Click OK. And wait a couple of seconds. While we're waiting for that, we can go ahead and get our Twitch key and our Chrome key and our YouTube key. So go to Settings, go to Stream. Then, depending on what you guys want to stream on, depending on all of these, you guys can stream to them. So for this demonstration, I'll be showing both. So let's go to Twitch. Then let's go to Chrome. Let's open that up. Go to Twitch.com. Open up your dashboard. Now, if you guys don't know where your dashboard is, go up here go dashboard and click that next what you guys want to do is go straight to your channel and then you guys will be here in stream key and preferences all you got to do is copy your stream key go back to OBS go to settings paste click apply same thing goes for YouTube all you got to do is go to YouTube go to your my channel then go to dashboard then go all the way to live stream and scroll all the way down and get your key which it get your key which is all the way down there copy your key change all that change that to YouTube right there and after you change it put that in that's basically it for this tutorial guys that's it to do that and once you guys see your little area here you guys can stretch that out depending on what you put for your size for me I definitely put 920 by 1080 most likely so we can check our video what you guys want to do is if your computer or PC whatever it is can handle it be sure to put it up here base and output but if it honestly can't put it down just a little bit just to make it you know playable you guys don't want to have too much um, 60 frames per second always if your computer is lagging right now and very slow try to make that to 30 you know just play with these settings you guys will figure out what your PC can handle and what it can't handle after that make sure to click apply this works just the same for Xbox PS4 should work on Nintendo switch as well guys as long as you have an Elgato capture card the new one or the old one it should work that's basically it for this video guys hope you guys did enjoy as you guys can see you guys can start your stream start your recording or do whatever you guys want thank you guys for watching this video hope you guys did enjoy be sure to leave a like and subscription for me and a notification bell love you guys so much see you guys in the next one peace